Hey there, Tony Policastro here, host of the Acoustic Tuesday Show, founder of Tony's Acoustic Challenge, and full-time guitar geek. I've got a great treat for you today because we're gonna be looking at the McPherson Sable, part of their Carbon series of guitars. <laughs> The McPherson Sable is visually striking, and yes, it is 100% carbon fiber. I'm talking the top is carbon fiber, the back is carbon fiber, and yes, the neck is carbon fiber as well. Let's get into some of the details, and I think you probably noticed one of the most striking ones, and that is the top. Yes, it's carbon fiber, and yes, it has that kind of typical carbon fiber weave, but there's a little twist. There's a honeycomb pattern on the top, which I find incredibly visually appealing, and just an overall treat to look at. Also on the top, you've got the McPherson offset sound hole, and included with the guitar is a feedback buster. So if you do plug it in and find yourself prone to feedback, you can plop that in there and it'll reduce it significantly. As I mentioned, this guitar does come equipped with a pickup. You can access the volume control right in the sound hole. The bridge is composite, as is the saddle and bridge pins. And let's move to the neck. I wanna actually spend some time on the neck because there's a lot of really cool features on this neck. Yes, it's made of all carbon fiber. I also wanna call attention to the composite nut, which is an inch and three quarters. I find it very comfortable to play. It's got a shallow or low C profile, and it's kinda got this beautiful satin finish, and my fingers just literally slide on the neck. I don't find myself getting hung up. It's very comfortable to play, bar chords are easier on it, and overall the action is pretty darn low and comfortable as well. Couple more notes on the neck itself. It is cantilevered, which means that the fingerboard extension actually hovers above the top of the guitar, which allows the top to really reach its full potential in terms of in terms of maximum vibrating surface. And I think you'll hear it when I play it. This guitar produces a ton of sound. One of the most striking things I found out about the McPherson Sable is actually the sound. Usually with carbon fiber guitars, I generally put them in the more stringy, treble heavy category. That was not the case with this particular guitar. I found it to be incredibly balanced. I found the bass to be very resonant. I found the treble strings to really speak. And overall, it's incredibly balanced and articulate. Um, I was amazed, both finger picking and flat picking, how this guitar responded and that it actually did respond. I didn't have to push this guitar uh, very heavily to get sound out of it. In fact, with a light touch, I thought it was very freely offering pretty robust sound. A couple more visual notes on the headstock, we've got the that same carbon fiber weave pattern, the McPherson badge. We've got gold shallower tuners, which work really, really well. And again, I think match the overall killer look of this guitar. Some of us traditionalists, and I would put myself in that category, say, you know, I, I like wood guitars and that's all I like. This carbon fiber stuff, it's for the birds. I want you to check out one of these guitars. Whether it's in your local guitar shop or you have a chance to actually just hear it, this guitar is very capable, and I think if you close your eyes, you would find yourself surprised at how akin to wood, a wood guitar it actually sounds. And a couple more notes, if you find yourself playing outside frequently, 
This guitar is not susceptible to heat. It's not susceptible to humidity. It doesn't move like a wooden guitar does. So it's extremely stable and very durable. One more note on the durability. Since it is carbon fiber, there's really no maintenance to it, but also the frets. Let me call attention to the frets. They're gold Evo frets, which are incredibly hard and very durable. So in terms of durability, this guitar is gonna go the distance with you. It's really not gonna fall apart due to wear and tear. It's not gonna react to humidity, as I mentioned before, and it's a road dog for sure. So overall, the McPherson Sable is a stellar instrument. I am very, very impressed with this instrument. As I mentioned before, it knocked my socks clear off my feet, through the window, and out on the street. I am, I am so happy to be able to play this guitar and share it with you. So again, if you find yourself in your guitar shop and they have these hanging on the wall, pull it down and give it a play. I think they'll be, uh, I think it'll be a surprising experience for you. And one more thing before I let you go. If you're a guitar geek, which I assume you are, I want you to subscribe to this channel because it offers a ton of guitar geek inspiration for you, mainly the Acoustic Tuesday Show. It airs every Tuesday at 10 a.m. Mountain Time and is your weekly dose of guitar geekism. It offers inspiration, gear, you're gonna find new artists, and overall you get to wave your guitar geek flag and join forces with other guitar geeks. Again, every Tuesday, Tuesday at 10 a.m. here on this channel. Don't forget to subscribe and thank you so much for your time. Guitar Geeks Unite!